Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to another video and welcome back to another episode of Space Plan. Alright, so I think we actually have less wattage than we did at the start of the last episode. But that's because from when I'm recording this episode, uh, the difference in time between this episode being recorded and the last episode being recorded is shorter than the last episode being recorded and the episode before that being recorded that made any sense at all I kind of just confused myself I'm lucky that I got that out but um, yeah so I imagine that's why the wattage is lower if it is at all I can't remember um, I think it is it, it, it seems like it is anyway uh, we're gonna first of all get that up to 35 we're just waiting on new ideas here because uh, it doesn't seem like we're getting anything why don't we just take this up to a hundred why don't we just do that? There we go. Cool. Now we got a hundred planet mashers. Pleasant. All right. Because I, I I looked at this up here and it was like target hit, keep going. I'm like, hey, target hitters. So I bought more of them. Doesn't seem to be doing anything though. Which one's Mars, by the way? Is this one Mars? Is this us? Or is this us? I don't know. I can't tell. I mean, from this perspective, we look small. But from this perspective, I don't know which one we are. Huh. All right, well, we do have 27 billion watts, so we should probably spend them. Take that up to 40. Let's just do that. Why don't we get that up to 42? Cool. All right, so we spend it. <laughs> I, I'm I'm just waiting to see if it'll do something. There's got to be something I'm missing here. Because I... I got to be able to trigger a new idea. Like, or pro, uh, trigger something that'll progress the story here. Because we've kind of been sitting at this for a little while now. And I'm getting a little worried that... It's going to take a while before we actually reach that point. But, uh... Who knows, you know. Hopefully it won't. Because, I mean, I'd really prefer that it don't. Oh, we can barely make it to 125. Something's happening, though. Looks like we just needed to buy enough planet mashers. Oh, shit. Yo, getting this. We got this 3D thing going on here. What the fuck? This is, <laughs> this, this is kind of tripping me out a little bit. Just look at the perspective on this. This is so weird. It's so cool at the same time. The fuck? Because it literally looks like these fucking things, whatever they are, planet mashers or something, are coming out of the screen. Uh, coming out of my computer screen. It feels like they should be going out of my computer screen anyway. Fucking hell. Yeah, I don't know what just happened, but apparently we did trigger something, so... Maybe we're getting there. Target hit one more. Okay, so we, the last time it said that, we were at 75, then 125. So I'm imagine we got to take it up to 175, right? Let's go for it. Yeah, okay, we ain't there yet. Got to wait a little while longer for that. Oh, nope. Okay, we did it. Done. Here goes. What is going on here? Now we look like a, like a flower or something. And uh, just so you guys are aware, I don't have my headphones on at the moment, so if there are any cool sound effects, which I imagine there are, I can't hear them right now. And I don't have my headphones on because, as I explained in yesterday's Space Plan episode, fucking headphones hurt my ears. These particular n new ones that I have. So I gotta, I, gotta, I gotta work it out. I just gotta power through it. Eventually it'll go away. And now we're just destroying all the planets. Skip to Neptune. Our skipper engine will have us outside of Neptune in no time. Yeah, let's go to Neptune. Let's scan Neptune. So are we just going through all the planets at this point? Because I mean, like... It's going to take us a while. There seem to be, you know, quite a few planets in the solar system that we're in. 
but uh, hey, what do I know? Uh, why don't we just get this up to 150 so that we can have a number that is that coincides with these other ones? All right, so something else happened. Now it looks like a, the fucking Death Star or something. I don't know. I'm, I'm trying to make that kind of comparison, but I have never actually seen a Star Wars movie, so... Probably inaccurate. Okay, we got some trippy shit going on here. This game is real fucking trippy when you think about it. You just stare at these visuals and you're like, what the hell is this, man? You're just like, oh, it screws with your eyes. A little bit, at least mine. I'm probably the only one, though. Because I'm weird like that. Well, okay, hang on. Neptune's probably nicked half the natural satellites in the solar system. Well, get to it. Looks like they all need to be activated. Luckily, we have planet mashers. You can use them to launch a bunch of tater at once and hit the targets easier. Okay, so it looks like we need to buy more planet mashers. That's what I intend on doing. It's just buying... Hundreds upon hundreds of planet mashers. And stuff is going down now. It looks like. Or maybe. I don't know. Do we have to wait to buy a tall tater or something? Because it did mention taters in there. But I don't know. Or are we just... Kind of... Waiting for something to happen. I don't, I don't know. I'm going to wait to buy a tall tater or two or five or something. Oh, I got the hiccups. God damn. I hate that. Randomly get the hiccups. And then they go away about two minutes later. And you completely forgot that you even had them. But then they come back and you're more annoyed because you remember that you had them twice before. You know, within... The last 30 minutes. Uh, by the way, I wanted to mention this. Um, 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time tonight. If you're watching this on the 11th. If you're not watching this on the 11th, it means you're watching it past the 11th, which means you can still do this. I'm uploading my first review video. Uh, it's an album review of uh, Linkin Park's One More Light. So check that out. 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. July 11th. If it's already past July 11th, the video is there. It The title will be relatively self-explanatory, so you should be able to find it pretty easily. Mind you, it's my first review video of that fashion, so probably be cringeworthy on some degree, but I tried. So I'm going to give myself props for that and be done with it. Um, and I'm looking forward to do more, doing more review videos in the future because it was real fun to do. Got me real excited to talk about that. Because it's uh, something that means a lot to me, so. Obviously, I'm compelled to get excited about it and talk about it in that kind of way. But, uh, yeah, check it out. Um, I'd, I'd love any and all feedback on it. Because it is something new, so. You know, you guys can tell me how I can improve. Tell me what you like. Tell me what you didn't like. Tell me what I should review next. You know, that kind of stuff. That kind of stuff. But uh, I'm not going to waste any of your more, any more of your time. Jesus Christ. I just got finished recording, um, what's it, Antihero, right? And I was having trouble speaking that entire video. And it seems that that is carried over to this video because I keep saying the wrong things. You know, I know what I want to say. It's just my mouth has a completely different idea. It's like, hey, you want to say something smart? Here, I'm going to screw it up for you. You want to at least sound smart because what you're actually saying probably isn't that smart at all. Here, I'm going to screw it up for you. Make you sound st stupid. You know, even more so than you normally would. So, I mean, that's just the kind of day I've been having. <laughs> nah, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm joking. I mean, that has been happening, but I'm over-exaggerating. I've actually had a pretty decent day so far. It is close to 5 in the morning. I've been up for all 5 hours of this day so far. Not real healthy. 
talked about our my sleep schedule in the last episode of Space Plan. Yeah, haven't really gotten back on track. I said maybe I should, and I know it's a good it, it's a good idea to get back on track. No, it's just it just didn't happen. You know, it just did not happen. Um, I just got shit to do. Just got loads and loads and shit to do. Luckily, I have the energy to record, because otherwise I'd be scrambling for time again. Uh, so I'm pumping out some content. Um, for the first time ever on the channel today, July 11th, I'm putting out five videos. You know, 9 a.m., noon, 3 p.m., 6 p.m., 9 p.m. So it's kind of hectic a little at the moment. I If I didn't do this now... I was never going to be able to get around to it. That's just how it is. Uh, so I'm, I'm glad I'm knocking this out now. And that, uh, you know, I'll be able to put out all five videos today. Because I, I, I already promised myself that I would. And I already promised Twitter that I would. And I can't let down Twitter. And I know I can't let down myself. So just got to pull through. And after this video, all I'll have left to record for today is Nuclear Throne. And then I'll probably get started on tomorrow's content because I do want to get a jump on the content that I'm putting out. Because I feel like I never do that anymore. I never get real ahead on the content I'm putting out. Which, I mean, I wish I could. It's just sometimes... Actually, a lot of the time, I lack the energy to record. But I have just enough energy to do something else. You know, something completely time-consuming and mind-numbing. Which I hate. I really hate, but it's a habit that I've got to break. And that sort of rhymed. Rhymes just enough to sound good. I should write that down. I should put that in my notepad. I don't have a notepad, but I should get a notepad and I should write that down. And then that'll be like part of the chorus of my hit single. You know, those angsty lyrics and with the with the with a catchy beat or something. I don't fucking know what I'm talking about. It, it's five o'clock in the morning, alright? What 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 do you want me to do? Okay? I'm trying to find stuff to talk about. I like I'm slightly delirious, but I have enough energy to keep going. Uh you know what, we're going to wait, I think, maybe, judging by how slow it's going, we may not want to wait around. Actually, we can wait around. We can wait around. Uh, we'll buy a tall tater this episode, and then we'll call it. Um, oy. I think I might actually go to sleep for a little while before I get to recording the other video, Nuclear Throne. Uh, I do have time to do it. I just... Oh, holy shit. I'm exhausted. I should... I, I'm glad I got this taken care of before I gave it any thought. Because if I had given it any thought, I would have chosen to go to bed instead of recording this. So I'm glad I knocked this out. And uh, all I'm sacrificing, you know, is decent commentary. Cue the... Uh, the the comment about how my commentary isn't good to begin with. Cue it right there. Yeah. I understand how I am. I'm a real pessimistic person. I have, a low, I have low self-esteem. Do not hold myself very highly. I understand how I am. I do it for the laughs and the giggles. Although the only person I'm making laugh is probably Jesus Christ. He's probably sitting up there or something laughing at me like, fucking idiot the fuck are you talking about? You're so stupid. So stupid. The only person that you make laugh is me. And it's because I'm so ashamed. <laughs> what the fuck am I talking about? Uh. <sighs> oh, man. Oh, man. You know, um... Talking about the review video a little bit. I'm not going to talk about the review video itself, but it does bring up, or it does remind me, 
of um, this new, well, he's not new necessarily. Like his channel isn't new, but he's new to me. That's that's what I mean. Um, this new channel I found on YouTube. Um, I forget what his what the username is, but he has a series on there, or I guess that might just be the entirety of the channel. I don't know. He has different series going on there. One of his series is Mike the Snobby Music Guy. I I I can't remember it off the top of my head. Um, but he has that on there, which is just him talking about music. Um, and he's very, you know, musically inclined. He's very intelligent in that regard. Uh, more like more so than the average human being. Um, so I, I was binge. I have been, and I still am binge watching some of his content, uh, mainly the stuff where he reacts to, um, react videos from the fine brothers, uh, where they're reacting to music in some form. I watched them. I watched him react to teens react to Lincoln park um, obviously, why would I not watch that? Uh, I watched him react to, um, adults react to Despacito, um, bunch of other ones. You know, he's a very funny guy. Um, and his voice sounds fantastic. Like, um, this is coming from someone who doesn't have a whole lot of experience being on the radio, but has some experience. And, uh, yes, in case you guys didn't know, I am. Um, on the radio. Only one hour per week, but I'm still on the radio here in Cleveland um, on a channel that only old people really listen to, so you guys would not be that interested, I imagine, uh, unless you're of the older age, which I am sorry for offending you in the first place. But uh, the radio station I... Um, I work with uh, and I do actually go live on air um, the radio station I work with the demographic is definitely an older audience um, 100% and for anyone that's a Cleveland native you can probably guess what station it is but I'm not going to reveal it because I don't want you guys trying to pinpoint me on there or anything not that I imagine that anyone Watching this video would do that because I don't have enough of following for anyone to want to do that. And I'm not that interesting of a guy anyway. But still, I do not want to risk that. But I do have experience on air. Not a whole lot. Again, I've only been doing it for about a year. But I do have experience on air. Um, and, and like, it, when you have experience on air and you hear yourself on air and you're get you get used to just talking on air you begin to like be able to recognize who would have a good radio voice and who wouldn't and this guy would have a fantastic radio voice like he needs to get on radio um either that he needs to get a fucking podcast or something because he the dude's got a great voice he's got this very deep voice that's just real nice to listen to and it's pro it probably helps that he has a very good mic you know much better than mine um, or at least it sounds better than mine. Um, or he makes it sound better than mine. Don't know which one it is, but he, uh, he has a very, very nice voice. Um, I know I botched the name of the series I mentioned, but if you just search that, I'm sure you'll find who I'm talking about. I think his, the channel name's like Become the Knight or something. Uh, you know, Knight, K-N-I-G-H-T. Uh, if you just listen to any of those videos where he's talking you'll understand exactly what i'm talking about he he definitely has a voice for radio and i mean it wouldn't surprise me at all if he is on radio but i don't think he is um because he talks about radio from this outsider's perspective so i imagine he's not on there but he really should be he really should be even if he has no experience in broadcasting whatsoever he really should be on radio he's got the voice for it and you don't even have to have experience in broadcasting in order to necessarily be on radio. As long as you got a good voice and you're, uh, 
yeah, as long as you got a good voice and you can articulate, uh, then you're set. And I can't necessarily articulate, but when I know what I want to say and I've practiced it, then I'm okay, you know. And that's essentially what I do when I'm on air, is I practice what I'm saying and then I say it. And then it sounds okay, at least to some people. That's what people have told me when they listen, which I'm real appreciative of. It makes me feel good. But, uh, all right, we bought that tall tater. It's enough talking for today. That's enough filling your mind with this boring shit. Keep talking about myself, my life. You guys don't give a flying fuck about that, I imagine. But I do it anyway, because I, cause I don't care. I'm just speaking out of my ass at this point. It's five o'clock in the fucking morning. All right, cut me some slack. I had to find something to talk about. My mind feels like it's going to implode on itself. So I I had to find something. But uh, if you guys are enjoying this series, let me know down in the comments section below. Like the video and share with your friends. It lets me know you want to see more of any game series I do here on the channel. The link down to the game is in the description box down below if you want to pick it up for yourself. And if you guys enjoyed this video in particular, again, all likes and comments are greatly appreciated. Subscribe to my channel for more gaming content. I play all sorts of games on my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you very much. And I'll talk to you later. And yes, I am well aware that I slurred my words together. That was not intentional. I'm just really tired. <laughs>